Oh. Oh. Oh my god, guys. Seriously, what a nightmare it was. Seriously. Final score, it Reading nil, Ipswich 4. It's ridiculous, guys. Beyond a joke. It's utterly beyond a joke. I mean, I've been a, Re a Reading supporter for years, since the 2009-10 season, when we... when we um, beat Portsmouth that day. But since then... This season, it's gone. It has gone downhill. I am telling you now. Seriously, I am. I am pissed off. Seriously, how many times have I seen a Reading team fail this season? It's been absolutely stupid. I mean, the chances we've created. They weren't taken. I mean, how many more times will will we see this in the championship? Today was our chance to secure survival. To make sure we're in the championship or next season. Well, oh no. And, but oh no, we had to get that in their face, didn't they? Plus, it was our final home game in the season. So... Reading fans out there, I'm completely, I'm completely ashamed for you. Seriously, I am so, I'm sorry for you at the minute. I mean, to witness something like that in your final home game. I mean, I mean, all right, Ipswich, they were a way better side. But Reading, at least they should have come out fighting today. I mean, Paul Clement, he should. I mean, I see no reason why he shouldn't be giving those players an absolute, an absolute telling off at it full time. Really, I don't. See, the reason they were poor, I mean, John Swift, he passed the ball out play like four times. Four times. And, and I mean, Sonny Luco, I mean, he wasn't exactly great either. I mean, when he takes the shots, he really hit it wide or it just went straight at the keeper. And that was most of our, what our shots were. I mean, they were just either at straight at the keeper or way wide at the target. I mean, Chris Gunn's had a shot today. That was straight at the keeper. But, I mean, the best chance we had to actually get a goal was that deflected shot from Mo Barrow that hit the cross that is the post that was the closest we came now and then we had before that we had a shot from John Swift it was a beautiful counter attack at John Swift he hits that straight he hits that at the keeper and the keeper comes to and the keeper saves it. And that had to be our, our closest chance after that one. Seriously. It's ridiculous, guys. And now we go into, into our game against Cardiff on the back of this humiliation. I mean, is this, is this what fans want? I mean, seriously. This season... For Reading, has been a complete embarrassment since the since the first game against QPR at Loftus Road. It has been one of the it's been the worst season I have ever experienced as a Reading supporter. Seriously, I mean the two managers we got at the moment. I mean Yap Stam, terrible manager. I mean he got his tactics wrong, the players wrong. Plus, he also, as a manager, he made the wrong choices as well. I mean, Tyler Blackett, come on. Even Omar Richards was, is better than him. And still, he didn't actually get a place on the app stamp. And then Paul Clement arrived, and then we were saying, 
Oh yeah, the, oh yeah, he's gonna bring it's going great luck. Where's the great luck? I mean, all right, he didn't have a he didn't have a good first game against QPR, the one 0 thanks to Renone. But apart from that, where's the luck gonna come from? I mean, how much more can we take? Us Reading fans, we are sick and tired of seeing the same thing. Oh yeah, hit that upfield. Pa no, pass back. T take the same shot. We, we, we're all tired of that. Why can't we just see another manager? I really don't know guys, seriously. It's ridiculous. And it's embarrassing. Seriously as a Reading supporter. Absolute embarrassment. Today. And from the season. And from the season. But, we don't beat Cardiff. And Burton, Burton and Birmingham both win their games. We could be relegated come, come at least, I don't know, 3 o'clock on Sunday the 6th of May. Which is basically next Sunday. So I am, I am saying this on our behalf. Reading players, we don't want to see our side in League One next season. We want to be seeing our club fighting with the very best. Like Leeds United, Queen's Park Rangers, Sheffield Wednesday, Sheffield United, Derby County. Those types of teams. We don't want to be battling Charlton Athletic, Shrewsbury, Rotherham, Oxford United, Accrington Stanley, Luton Town. We don't want to be playing those types of games. So, get your act together. And do us proud against Cardiff next Sunday. And guys, if you have liked this video, please um, subscribe to my channel. And please put a like on this video. I mean, seriously, we're in trouble if we don't beat Cardiff. So, this is Football Fan 148 signing out. Peace guys. Peace.